Well, it's a movie that has survived the test of time. The Sandlot originally premiered back in 1993 and has supplied an endless amount of pop culture references. And today, some lucky fans will be able to see it and be surrounded by some of the cast members. It's all part of the Alamo Draft House's Rolling Road Show. And with us this morning, we have Patrick Renna, who was Ham in the movie, and Chauncey Leopardi, who we know as Squints. Thanks so much for coming in, guys. Thanks for having us. Yeah. I I have so many questions because I feel like a lot of people my age, we all grew up watching this movie, I feel like, on repeat. Um, so just tell us a little bit about what it was like to be a part of such an iconic movie. I mean, it's the gift that keeps on giving, I think, uh, and it gets better as time goes on. Yeah. Um, filming it was amazing, obviously, as a kid. It's like, you know, the best summer you could ever have, playing with your friends. and. Uh, yeah, it was four months in Salt Lake for, with you know, nine guys playing baseball and getting paid for it. So yeah. Were you guys big great. fans of baseball? Did you guys play when you yeah. were kids? Yeah, okay. definitely. Uh -huh. So I bet it was cool because it's it set a few decades before it actually was filmed, but I bet that was cool to be able to kind of explore what it was like being a kid yeah. in a different time, right? Oh, yeah. I, you know, my dad said that when he saw the, the school outfits on us, it was exactly what he used to wear. So it was pretty, it was, even then was nostalgic for him but we I mean we had a great time you know I think that's also one of the things that makes the movie uh, last so long is that it is a period piece mm -hmm. even then so it's extra special you know yeah and we obviously know uh, that there are well, taking a look at, at the movie right there there are some really iconic scenes obviously uh, for squints I mean that scene with Wendy which one do you mean Oh, that one oh. <laughs> scene that I feel like every boy that wears glasses, that feels kind of nerdy. I feel like everyone loves that scene, yeah. right? Do people bring it up to you all the time? Oh, of course, you know. And uh, <laughs> I mean, it kind of shaped, I, I got to thank, tip my hat to David Mickey Evans, the writer, for like kind of shaping my romantic life with my first kiss. It was amazing. <laughs> was that your first kiss? Yeah, I was 11. I'm pretty sure it was my first kiss, yeah. And if it wasn't, I'm, I'm still taking that one. You never sure. give me the credit. It was actually originally written for me, and I just felt like it was better for him. Oh, so, gotcha. Yeah. That would have changed the story completely, yeah, I feel yeah. like. But I feel like, same thing for you. I, I, one of the scenes that I truly remember is the one where you guys are uh, going to the amusement park and everybody starts puking. And oh, yeah. How, how gross was that scene to actually shoot? Yeah, that was pretty gross. It was gross. pretty gross. Yeah. <laughs> I think yeah. it was split pea soup and, and uh, something, something else. chunky in Yeah, there. It, was, it was gross. And then the, the stuff we were chewing was beef jerky and, and black licorice. licorice. It was like... It, it made you want to puke Nobody anyway. Nobody really likes black licorice. No. So that's a, I, a I, tough I, flavor I, I, I there. No, I like black on. licorice. It was, I, it was so awful. <laughs> yeah. It made me almost actually yeah. you know, actually curl. do that one. Yeah. Let's talk a little bit about the screening because I bet it's really cool to be able to what it's been 26 years and be able to yeah. get so close up with the fans who obviously still love you guys for it. Yeah, it's it's great. I mean, we're we were just saying we've never been to a distillery, so yeah, it should be awesome. Hearing how great this place is. Yeah. So I do want to bring up that info, actually, while we're talking about it. It's going on today at 5 o'clock over at Treaty Oak Distillery. You still have some time to go get some tickets. Uh, it's going to be outside, and as we were talking about, the weather's going to be pretty good for it. But let's talk a little bit about some of those quotes from the movie. I mean, I feel like people have their favorites. Do you guys have a favorite, or did they get pretty annoying after 26 years? My, I think my favorite line is, uh, it's just been planning it for years. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. Yeah. Or I can't take this anymore. Yeah, there's a few. He's got yeah. some really good ones. Yeah. They give you some iconic ones. Yeah. I think my favorite one is uh, bacon like a toasted cheeser. <laughs> uh, you know, just it's not the one that gets a lot of credit. A lot. You always yeah. hear you're killing me smalls, but. Killing me smalls. Yeah. I do like forever. 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 Yeah. Yeah, All the great. memes are out there. I yeah. mean, so many fans out there. But I think that's great. You have kids, right? Yeah. Okay. So does both of you us. Both yeah. Have, yeah. Kids. Okay. have three. Yeah. So how great is it to be able to watch this movie and kind of be like, hey? Maybe it's just telling me that you just started showing Flynn his son. Yeah, my son's just turned two and a half, and he's very into cartoons. But my wife showed him Sandlot, so then. For about a week, every morning we would wake up and he'd say, "I want, I want, I don't want, I want to watch Dad play baseball. Dad play baseball." So <laughs> then we'd so sit cool. on the couch and watch a little Sandlot. Yeah, they, I, I think his favorite character is Squints, though. Yeah. It's wow. funny, Tom told me that too. Yeah, he said sure. it's good. He's Get out of here, bro. Tom's uh, son Jameson it. told me the same. He's yeah. like, he's your, you're his favorite character, bro. His Tom is small. Uh, yeah. Smalls, yeah. His daughter said, "Dad, why is Ham always so mad?" <laughs> you know, I don't know, honey. But there were so many good. 
parts for both of you guys. Yeah, well, yeah we had a good time. Again, for everybody at home, we want to bring up that info. You can still go check out uh, this Ultimate Sandlot movie party going on at Treaty Oak Distilling. It's part of the um, Alamo Draft House Rolling Road Show. And for more tickets and info, you can go to rollingroadshow.com. Kicks off at 5 o'clock. It'll be a good one. Thanks so much for coming in, guys. Hey, thanks for having us. Yeah, thank Come you. on down, guys.